Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Peglin. We're gonna jump in again. We're gonna turn off Crucible again, but I'm gonna jump back into Crucible on the next episode, I think. I just I think I need to find my footing, and I feel like I've done that here. I'm gonna take the uh, well done steak for the extra healing when we're loading. Uh, people have been telling me that I've been just not like taking healing relics anywhere near enough, so I'm gonna make sure to try and prioritize that at least a little bit here. Uh, so first of all, let's just try and get some money. Uh, a bomb off the bat is not bad. Double bomb would be pretty good. We have at least ignited the other ones. Um, these guys do take a bit of beating, so it's no worries. Uh, don't want to go for that. In fact, we ought to be discarding whenever we can when we need to be healed. Uh, just to try and get as much healing as we possibly can. Um, it's going to be pretty useful. But for now, right now, I'm just going to go for money. But yeah, uh, Peglin's been getting some updates. It's been getting um, a lot of attention recently from the developers, and I really love to see that, honestly. It's, like, even though it's still an early access game, it's not a game that I actually expected to, like, <clears throat> sort of... I didn't... It's not like I expect it to die in early access. I know some games do, but that, that's not really what I mean. It's more so that... I don't know. I kind of expected this game to stagnate a little bit and kind of lose its footing and sort of slow down the, the production. But honestly... They've done a really good job at, um, at keeping it going. Like, a really good job at keeping it going. So I'm very, very happy to see it. Because it is a, a game that's proper worthy of it. It really is. Um, we'll take that. I like those. Um, and I think we'll just continue on. We'll go for some treasure here. Lovely, lovely treasure. I do have a little bit of a raspy voice. I don't know if you can tell. Um, hopefully you can't hear it. Um, let's go with that. Hopefully you can't hear it. Hopefully it isn't too bad. But... Yeah, just a little bit of a raspy voice. I think I'm just coming down with a little bit of a, a cold. But yeah. Beautiful. Here, this is a pretty tough one, to be honest. We don't really have anything that's going to do a great job. Um, this is a heavy ball, so it's going to be a little bit rough. We don't particularly have anything that's going to do a great job here. Um, so this is just kind of it goes as it goes sort of thing. I'm going to go for the refresh. It's going to mean that this attack's really bad, but I'm hoping we get a crit. In this path here. Um, we didn't. This is a little risky. Because we could get really low damage here. But essentially. My plan is to get that crit down there. Oh, yeah. We unfortunately did get really low damage there. And yet again we got the crit off. And we don't want it. It's a little annoying. This is not going well. We're going to take quite a lot of damage from this guy. By the looks of it. Uh, 92. We still got so much health left. We're, we're getting, obviously, the extra bit of damage on the reloads, but it's just not enough. Uh, 190. We're probably going to lose a lot of HP here. This is by far what I consider to be the hardest early game elite. Uh, he just has such a large health pool that he's so hard to kill before getting hit. Um, the warp hammer is pretty good. I'm going to go with another orb Orbsium, though, because... I. Although I don't need them right now, I feel like they can be so good. Um, all orbs have persist. Whenever a crit deal uh, crit is triggered, deal your orbs damage to all enemies. That sounds kind of interesting. I'll try that out. Um, I'm going to go for more treasure here. Go down this way. I could go straight to the shop here and try and remove some stones to get more refreshes in. Uh, that could be a good idea. We'll see about that, though. Um... The, the damage to everything's pretty good. I like it. Okay, I think here we stall out and go for as much um, as much money as we possibly can get our hands on. We didn't get much. <laughs> um, continue on. So we could go to the shop here, or we could go for the chest. I think... I think I'm going to go for the shop if I can manage it. There you go. Because I've got an okay amount of money. And we're going to get an item from the Elite anyways. We definitely want to remove an orb. Let's just remove a random stone. And then honestly, let's buy another Orbsium. We'll just have a deck full of those things. <laughs> like, I don't know if this is a good build at all. Uh, I do need some other things. Really? Oh, we're so fucked here. We're so fucked. That's really bad. Um, yeah, that's that's not good at all, especially with the unupgraded Orbsiums. Like, they're, they're good, but they're not... Why did I not go the other way? I could have got an instant crit there. This is going to be real, sh real rough. I think we might die here. I think there's a very good chance we die here. 
Um, yeah, he's still got so much health left. We're doing like 40 damage a hit. It's just... It's not going to go well, is it, people? It's not going to go well. I need some big hits. Oh, come on now. 17 is not a big hit. Also, it would help if our refreshes weren't in terrible spots. We're dead. Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. That elite sucks big penises. And I... I'm not really sure. Is there, like, a, a definitive strategy for, like how to best defeat that guy. Or is it just, if you have the wrong build, screw you, I guess. Getting two of Minoru obviously doesn't help. That that was that was the big burner of, um, of our life there. Again here, we can probably stall to try and get some extra money. Love it when I, I just miss every single thing possible. I want to hit one of these new ones. What? Does that just mean it contains two coins? Because I'm trying to hit them, but I'm having a real hard time of it, I'll be honest. Yeah, it's just two money, nice. Okay. Let's actually go for the bombs now that everyone's in. Nice. Lovely. Good, good. Almost cleared the board of pretty much all the money on it, to be honest. Not bad. Um, deals dam uh, damage for each peg hit this battle. Can only be used once per battle. Wait, what? Maybe that's good when it's upgraded. Give that a go. Let's go random here. See what we get. Ah, oh, bollocks. I didn't realize that was something that could happen. Shit. Right, straight down. Straight to this chest. Upgrade an orb. Yeah, you can use it multiple times per battle now. Okay. I thought that would be the case. That's exactly what I was hoping for, really. Okay, this is not a bad start. This is just money finding here. Grabbing as much money as we can. Actually, a pretty good amount already. And the good thing about that one is it's a direct targeting orb as well, which means that we can do some funky stuff with it later on if we get, like, the mole boss or whatever. Okay, the fucking bombs are so hard to hit on this stage. I am trying, I promise, but... They're just a pain in the ass to hit. To the point where I always get hit a bunch of times. Wow, that was the best crit of my life. Holy shit, this damage is very warranted. Oh! I suck at this game so much. Just let me hit the bombs, please. God damn it, this is way too much damage to be taking here. Fuck me! Hit the bombs, please. That was devastating. That was way too much damage to have taken there. Um, I'm going to save my money here. I could heal, but nah. And then I've actually buggered myself up for getting down here, to be honest. So I've got to just wing it. Okay. Okay, that went not, that went okay. I lost some health, but it's all right. Max health by 15. Yeah, we'll go with a max health. That's decent enough, especially if we get some consistent healing down the line, which we don't have yet, but multiple versions of that to potentially get, so... Oh, okay. okay, this one's actually not too bad because it's basically just carve your way into the center of one of these. Um, which should be just about done here. Nice, there you go. Come 
we'll try it again right here. Beautiful. Good amount of money here. And a few extra bombs as well. Good, good. Okay, that went well. Good stuff. Again, hold, hold fire here. Seize fire. You can get some good stuff going. And of course, it's this bastard again. You jumped right over the crit. Thank you. I was going to say, if you missed that crit, I'd be so annoyed. 116 off the bat is actually really good. Set up for our next um, one of these. Eighty-six. Another hundred here, that's really good. We're still gonna take damage from this guy by the looks of it. Yeah, we're still gonna take at least one hit from this guy. 196 is good though. Need to hit that refresh. Guy's a bastard. I'm not going to get to 63, am I? Oh no, I got it, I got it, good. Okay. Now we'll definitely go for a heal here. Heal 6, unblock self-damage, can target any enemy. That's kind of interesting. Um, we need more sustain for that to be valuable, though. I'm going to go with that. And then I'm going to go this way. Okay. Hey, I'm glad that went this way. There's more elites too. Immune to attacks while reloading. Yeah, we'll go with that. It's decent enough. We can remove one here. Do we want any of these? Attacks apply four blind. It, it gives him a 4% chance to miss. It's just not worth it, is it? <clears throat> we could go with a restore orb. And then level that up a little bit. I'm going to say no, though. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to play it risky. Which I realise some of you will probably think is very foolish. But I'm going to try it anyways. Please don't be cow. Thank you. Th this one's can be just as bad, but for the most part it's not terrible. I'm a little annoyed at how poorly I missed there. Extra 100 there. Not quite a kill, it's a little annoying. Got the other bomb as well, lovely. hundred there, good. We get this orb straight back, which means it does a ton of extra damage. Not quite 150, but a good amount. I'm trying to get rid of that. Don't like where our refreshes are currently sitting here, I'll be honest. There you go. Let's go with a heal again here. When you would gain one max HP, instead, um, increase the amount gained by one. Okay. Let's go with the critical trigger thing again. I like that idea. And then, yeah, let's go all the way down this way, if we can. The game doesn't like me sometimes, so it's not always easy to do what you want to do, but... I'm going to gamble here and see if we can get that crit. Of course, went nowhere near it. Mostly okay. Now I'm just trying to carve a way for us to get to that bomb when we want to. We want to wait a bit before we trigger it if possible. We've lit it at least. Right, now we can use the bomb. And we got the refresh straight after. Not bad at all. Another kill. Easy crit. Completely missed it somehow. Good. That's an easy crit. It's 
200 damage on the dot as well. Good, good, good. I said on the dot. It wasn't actually on the dot. I don't know why I said that. Um, let's keep moving on. Another elite. Don't know whether to heal before the boss or not. Slime boss can be a little tricky. Not always terrible. 72. Good, good, good. Oh, for God's sake, why'd you bounce that way? It's fine, as long as you, I'm going to say, as long as you blow up a bomb, you've done your, you've done your worth. Really, I ought to be reloading a lot more often. I ought to be discarding, like, whenever I can to get to my, uh, Memorb. Really? Come up to my Memorb and these are the refreshes I have to play with? God damn it. Not great. So close to killing him there. Good, good. Right, let's heal just in case. That's really good, we'll take that. Every 12 pegs we <clears throat> we hit, we get a heal. I like that a lot. No way we're getting a crit here. Go for the bombs. At least ignited two of them, that's good. Another one got. Oh, got the crit as well there, nice. Well over 100 damage. Damn it, missed that. <clears throat> Tried to get that bomb, but missed it. Let's go for these outside bombs while we can. I think I've, I think I've royally forked this up, you know. And this is just not. He's gonna. He's already absorbed us. We're already inside. We just deal nowhere near enough damage to him either. That's not what I wanted to do. Try to get to, over to the bombs. We're not going to die, I don't think, but this still isn't great. Oh, that was terrible. What the hell? I should really hit a refresh here. There you go. 100. Yeah, we got him. Took a little bit of doing, but we got him. All pegs have durable. Yes, I think we want that. What's the point in this? Or maybe I suppose it's swashbuckle orb could be really good with it. Right, we need to shop as early as possible. We can go to the right to get to one. Basically, my thinking here is that having durable should make it so that we can get really crazy stacks on our Memorb, in theory. Makes it very hard to get to those two bombs, though, I'll say that for sure. Only just destroyed his shield, lovely. Okay, maybe this doesn't work out anywhere near as good as I thought. And also, ball sacks. We're on this stupid fucking stage again with no piercing. This is bullshit. They need to fix this. <laughs> oh, you're on this stage again with no piercing. Guess you're fucked. I, just, I don't know why the damage doesn't just move through the shield. Like, if I... If I deal damage over the health of the shield, it should just pass through automatically. That's all you have to do to fix it. Really. In my opinion. Ah, oh, I should have targeted the bat guy. I always forget with the, the, the orbs that let you target that you can change who you want to target.
Luckily, our healing's keeping us going, though. Um, that could be interesting. I enjoy those. I know it's quite expensive to do this, but I'm going to double upgrade that. We've got plenty of money for the shop, so don't worry about that. No. I really apologize. I really apologize. I don't know how long you guys have been listening to me do nothing there, but it's probably a while. I had to go answer a message and I went to click pause on the recording. I didn't. <laughs> Every reload, that's decent. Uh, yeah, I, I just didn't. So you guys had to unfortunately sit there and uh, have a full minute of just nothingness. I really hope you guys don't mind. I don't know how long it was. That's good damage though. Oh no, that's not direct damage though. It does fucking nothing. I forgot about that. I goddamn forgot about that. Oh yeah, our healing is just popping off right now. Lovely. Ooh, this is going to be good. Obviously, it does remove pegs permanently when it changes them into bombs, which is somewhat problematic for other um, thingies, but you can clearly see this is uh, this is pretty good. Like, it's pretty good. Anyways, we've also left just a ton of other bombs around. Okay, we might be turning this into a bit more of a bomb build than I was thinking. I was thinking Memo Up was going to be the, the main contender here, but it is not. Uh, one second. Okay, I actually remembered to pause this time. <laughs> Fool. Right, okay, we've got tons for our shop going into it here, so let's go straight to our shop. I'm hoping we can just buy a good few relics here. We can also remove another orb, which is very, very nice. Let's have a little look-see. Stones get a bit more. I start with some, some extra bombs, um, extra crit. Wall bounces contribute towards damage. I don't know how useful that is. I guess I'll take it. Why not? We've not got another shot coming up, have we? No, we don't. Right. Okay. Um, I guess we just slip it in here and it... I didn't think that was what was going to happen. But I'm kind of happy it did. Didn't actually do quite as well as I was hoping there, but that still was pretty decent. That's where I should have put it, look. Right there. Okay. This this bomb this bomb play, pretty good stuff. Um, still going to save my money, though, regardless. We can't really go wrong here unless we fall in the fire, so let's just go straight down. And look at that. We fell straight into the fire. There you go. Right for that. We can go for the elite in the middle here. Oh. Oh. <laughs> that is... Oh, there is a shop down here. Okay, okay, okay. Um. This is surely something. Okay, this, th this thing's probably going to bounce around for a good while here. A bomb's been detonated in a single hit. We are going to annihilate the entire board here. The durable pegs thing is kind of a weird. It works really well with this, but at the same time it doesn't. Because the bombs permanently replace where the, where the thingies would have gone. Okay, we mostly killed him here. 
Future bombs in there. The bombs are just good for keeping things in the air as well. There you go, beautiful. I was hoping we'd get another um, bomb orb somewhere around here. Two additional crits, two times as many bombs. I mean, just, we're already going that way. Why the hell wouldn't we? Uh, can we get this? Yes, we can. Nice. Uh, duh, 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 duh. Whenever you would lose health, reduce the amount lost by one. Let's, let's do that, yeah. And go for another shot. We've got a 144 here. That's not bad. Anything here that we want immediately? No. I think we just go for another removal then. And just remove another stone. I'd be pretty happy with that. Okay. I'm a little worried for the boss here. I'll be honest. Because we're just going to, like, bomb it so heavily that we might run out of pegs. We'll see how this works out. It's a weird potential build here. But it's, all, it's also a lot of fun. It's almost a thousand damage done already. Really, we'd ideally always want to start with this orb rather than the bomb one. Look how many bombs are on the fucking stage. It's crazy. Yeah, we'd always want to start with this one just because this one can do just actual real damage based on the pegs it hits. And then we move into the bomb one straight after to essentially clear everything out. Still, unfortunately, not got what we want here. Bombs deal extra damage. That seems uh, very good. Very, very good indeed. Duplicate all your orbs. Dupl you watch it duplicate. You know which one it's going to duplicate, don't you? You already know it. You already knew what was happening there. Everyone did. That was obvious. That was so obvious. Nothing else could have happened there. That was the only possible thing. Okay, half or over half his health done already. We did unfortunately just take a rather big hit here. Don't know how much we'll get out of this one. I'm hoping for at least 500. Eh, 410. Decent. Get some bombs down here. Don't fall all the way down, come on. Get boosted back up, there you go. Beautiful. Every attack is a crit, convert every eight pegs into a crit. Kind of interesting. Can't believe that game. Ooh. <laughs> that would be awful. Go with that. That would be legitimately the worst. Right. Oh, we got the new boss again. Which I didn't find really ha really that hard last time, so we'll see how it fares this time. Last time I had a pretty OP build. Ooh, the magnet thing is very, very nice here. Oh, I remember when the magnet used to be, like, the most broken thing on Earth. It used to be just ridiculous. It, it didn't have, like, a, a stopping period. It just magnetized forever. And literally, your orb would just be bouncing around the stage for an unlimited amount of time. It was just, it was just absolutely ridiculous. Fucking duplicated my goddamn stupid dagob. Why you like this game? I mean, dagob isn't bad. Obviously, you can put out some fat damage with this thing, but it's just like, come on now. Oop. Bulldog. Bulldog is proper piercing. I do kind of want it. I think I'm just going to start upgrading these bad boys, the shops that are over this way. So let's try and get over there.
Reduce self damage from all by 50%. That would have been really good with the other bomb thing, but oh well. Right, another shop. Removal's gonna be like 100 and something now, isn't it? Oh no, it's like 75, okay. Um, I think we wanna remove one of these again. And then we wanna take plus one discard. Good, good, good. And if we can get another shop before the boss, that'd be great. Additional refresh is nice. Okay, let's let's just not care here and uh, go for all the bombs. There you go. Lovely. It keeps wanting to give me this. So I guess I'll fucking take it. Not that it's useful in this stage, but it just won't leave me alone, so. Okay, other shop. If we go all the way left, we can get to another shop. So let's let's try and go as left as we can here. We have done it. The fact that we can't be hurt on reloads as well is pretty good. This should just kill everything on screen here. That it did. I realized I spent a bunch of money on upgrading my uh, my daggers for no reason there, but I didn't know I was going to get the ability to remove them both back to back like that. That obviously wasn't something I was expecting. That was not good. Dude. No. Don't do it to me, dude. He almost got there. He almost did the explosion. Luckily, we got him killed. Don't you dare. Okay, thank you. I was going to say, if that took me somewhere wild, I'd be so annoyed. Heal 6 when reloading. With the amount of reloads we're going to be doing, that's very, very good. Right, with the magnet on. This guy... I don't think we're going to kill him in one turn. Actually, it's plausible. It's plausible. Good thing is, is well, the crits don't matter here. Nah. You got another little while to go with this guy. That should do it, though. Yep. There you go. Docked Orb, um, that could be good for healing. Still just going to carry on. Bombs apply one blindness. That, that seems pretty good. <laughs> I don't know about you, but to me that seems like that could be quite strong. Basically anything that survives bombs is getting just a ton of blindness. Which means that's going to be really good for bosses. Right, down we go. Shop, what will you provide for me? I don't need to do any more removals here. I could remove Memo, but I just don't really see the point. Um, bomb steel plus 10 damage. The, there is one of these available... The only problem with it is it's not actually that good for me because I can't upgrade it. I guess I'll just take this and then go. Yeah, okay, because I have no way of upgrading it. Oh, I do. Dumbass. <laughs> I thought I was right next to the boss for some reason. It doesn't matter. We get more reloads this way, which is potentially dangerous, but considering we can't be damaged on reload, it's not too bad. <laughs> Good, good. You're dead, good. How many bombs did we get here? A good few. And you're dead. Nice. And our health is still looking fabulous. 
That somehow worked out for us. Right. We'll see how much we end up getting on this one. Beautiful. And into the boss we go. Into the fire we go, then, should I say. Into the fire we go. Can, we, can you stop putting me in the fire? This seems like it's going to be agony. There you go. That took a while. Right. Boss time. Still don't really know how this boss works. I'm basically just hoping that... I spawn enough bombs to somehow deal 6,500 damage to him, which I'm feeling is not going to happen. Basically, as I understand it, this is like some sort of Minesweeper minigame type thing. I'm just going to rely on bombs doing all the work. I'm a little scared about the fact that we're going to run out of pegs to use for bombs, because there's not that many here. We got 43 blind. I I actually think there's a certain possi a certain chance, a possibility, that we lose... That we, we, like, use up more pegs than we actually have ability to kill this guy. There's a, there's a chance that we don't kill this guy. That's not a lot of pegs left, if you look on the board. And after that, we're a bit fucked. I actually think this is this is going to be impossible, you know. Unless there's a way to generate more pegs, which I don't think there is. Because there's, like, fucking none left. And we have so much damage left to deal. I mean, the 69 blind's pretty good. I might just have to rely on Memorb. I'll do one more of these. And I think I've got to rely on Memorb. Because it keeps stacking is the good thing, so it's always going to deal good damage. So we, we get rid of that. Discard that again. Another 400. But that's the thing. Oh, no, the 400 is direct damage to him. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Okay, we killed him. Okay, that was that was risky. That could have gone a lot worse. I'm very glad I didn't get rid of the memo because that, that was clutch. But there you go. That was a very good run. I hope you guys did enjoy that one. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.